Hello guys and welcome back everybody to the brand new honest reaction video and this one is Patreon requested it's for Lima thank you so much for sponsoring it so today we're going to be checking out FT Island's relatively new song called burn it it came out like a month ago so yeah let's begin with it now but before we jump in guys don't forget to check out my patreon where you firstly can request a song or a video like this and also see more than 500 exclusive reaction videos including reality variety shows uh live stage reactions by groups like ntt uh exo super m uh taemin taeon snsd shiny espa iu new jeans and others then Dan shows like Street Woman Fighter Book Season, Street Man Fighter and Street Dance Girls Fighter, K movies and K drama reactions like My Mister, Hotel de Luna, It's Okay to Not Be Okay, Scarlet Heart, 81 Class, Goblin, Descendants of the Sun, The Glory, Sky Castle and many many more. So if you'd like to see all of that, the link to my Patreon and also to the content guide of all my Patreon content is down below in the pinned comment. And here we go, here we go, let's begin. So recently I reacted to a couple of stages by them, by FT Island, and also some time ago I reacted to uh, the killing voice of the main singer of FT Island. So let's see how this one is going to be. Mm -hmm. Ooh, he he's really using a lot of airflow here in in the tone. Kind of that husky quality. Wow, guys, so, so, this is what I also noticed and really enjoyed in some of my uh, live performance reactions, live performances done by them. So, he's got a very strong vibrato, very, like, it's pretty wide, it's very rock-sounding, and, and here it's also so, 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 so prominent, even though it's, like, a song with um, modern production style and in modern music everything sounds the same volume like the quiet parts and the really loud parts even though the singer is really singing very loudly into the microphone everything is compressed so everything is the same everything sounds the same volume and that's done in attempt to make the whole song on average louder because it's like a thing where we like louder music better so there's like a higher chance for people to like a song if it sounds louder so it's done like that but still even even though it sounds just as loud as some of the quieter parts you can just feel the power right here during the i guess it's the pre-chorus or the chorus like Oh, like, it, it, he's got so much energy in his voice. Oh, nice guitar. Nice guitar right there. Oh, that was the course, right? I also really like that bass line in the background. Boom, 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 boom. Nice layering here of his voice. 
here it's just only like si a single vocal track and here it's several I remember he's also a very good singer. <laughs> I, I like how we transition into the chorus with this long. Mm. Wow, sounds pretty mysterious, I would say. Okay, okay, so now let's see if it has... Okay, it's got lyrics, so let's listen to it once again from the beginning with the lyrics. Right, so this was Burn It by FT Island. And firstly, I gotta say how even though the budget for the music video, as I imagine, wasn't that high, they really did the best with, with what they had. Like they added this color coding, made a lot of the scenes, a lot of the lighting just red, right? To convey this feeling, even the the final, uh, like the final frame here with the word burn it, it's also red. So it makes sense, it followed the theme. So I think the music video for, um, like, 
how little probably they had i'm not sure but i assume that they don't have the biggest budget out there uh it looked it looked really good and really well done now about the song itself so first when i just and of course everything that i'm saying here is just my personal perception right and my personal uh musical taste how i feel it so when i first heard the chorus i was like wow wow so the power in the vocals it's just i i could feel the energy right he's a very very good singer so i could feel it um so i enjoyed the chorus uh but it sounded like i i think i even mentioned that i was like i'm oh i'm not sure if that's the chorus or maybe the pre-chorus um so it's sort of like an anti-drop not not the usual anti-drop that we think of probably because uh usually it's like mm, it's done a little differently differently but here the intensity sort of drops maybe just a little bit right compared to the verse uh and the chorus itself doesn't feel very big it's pretty short right just in terms of the length it's pretty short um there is not much of this instrumental break and there's not much of melody change it's it's kind of like the same rhythm the similar sounding line repeated and uh so the first time i heard it i was like wow this is cool this is cool and then the second time and the third time because there was no change it stayed the same maybe a little a little change in terms of the instrumental it became just a little bit more um intense and filled out towards the end it felt like it was and and plus it's a short song but we have three choruses in it so it just they, they have to be shorter uh so because of that i felt like the choruses just didn't i don't know didn't have the the impact that i would assume from the way he was singing because again the way he was singing his voice had so much impact but the structure of the chorus had much less impact so i felt a little bit of that disbalance there uh imbalance so i don't know i i i, I enjoyed it i enjoyed it but probably because of his voice like mainly i enjoyed his voice how he was singing the sound of his voice everything that it had to do with his voice i like the song because of that and how the instrumental went and how it was structured i like that much less so it, it's it's kind of like that i'm in the moment i'm not really sure if i'm going to continue listening to this one um but yeah i can certainly appreciate that he's such a good singer man such a such an amazing singer and he's he's got um a very powerful sounding voice even without really going super high like to showcase that power that he's got he doesn't need to go woo, into the fifth octave you know he can stay in his range where he's pretty comfortable but it's still going to sound very very powerful so yeah something like this for this one guys thank you all so much for watching thank you lima for sponsoring this one and catch you guys in the next video as always take care keep listening to great music and love